A flight board in Singapore showing the uncertainty surrounding the whereabouts of missing AirAsia flight 8501. At Singapore's airport, the plane's destination, people gathering around an AirAsia service counter, anxious to learn about those aboard. <laughs> Airline officials say the plane was carrying 162 people, including two pilots and cabin crew. 42 minutes after taking off from Surabaya in Indonesia Sunday, the plane lost contact, officials said, in airspace possibly thick with dense storm clouds, strong winds and lightning. It went missing an hour before it was scheduled to land. Indonesian transportation officials say the last communication between the pilot and air traffic control was when the pilot asked to turn left and climb 34,000 feet to avoid clouds. AirAsia says the Airbus A320 was on its submitted flight plan route and it's believed to have gone missing somewhere over the Java Sea. Local news stations in Indonesia showed family members and friends of the missing passengers gathering to wait for any news. The country's vice president offering his concerns over the flight. Saying there is a big possibility it was involved in an accident. The government regrets and is deeply concerned about what has happened. Indonesia, Singapore and Malaysia have launched search and rescue operations over the Java Sea. Aircraft searching for the missing flight called off the effort for the evening, but some ships were continuing the search overnight. It's the third airline incident this year to affect the region, with Malaysia Airlines losing a plane in July when it was shot down over Ukraine. And in March, Malaysia Airlines Flight 370 disappeared with 239 people aboard. Padmanandarama, The Associated Press.